Hello everyone, welcome back. Today's been a good day. We uh, haven't done anything farm related today. <laughs> but, uh, well yeah, I have to. I'm sorry. Uh, I have, I forgot about that. But, uh, it was a good day. I got my first check for some of the little bit of broccoli we cut early. Uh, that's always a big day farming when the money quits going out and starts coming back in. Uh, and according to the weather forecast, we may get enough window weather. Weather window. Jeez. And uh, to get back to mowing hay. So uh, we've got the one 20 acre, give or take a few acre field to cut and we'll have first cutting done and I really want to get it done it's uh, a week from yesterday's fourth day of July I like to have first cutting done by the fourth of July so uh, not always works out that way but you know that's that's what we try for so but uh, real quickly while I'm here I'll show you Mr. Skippy, he's a growing. Levi's bottle calf. He is dirty. It's muddy. But uh, Mr. Skippy is growing. Looking good. He's a pretty good calf. I think they weighed him. Uh, about two weeks ago, he weighed almost 230. So he's coming on. He's wanting something to eat. He's got plenty to eat. So, uh, but uh, say skip. Bye, Skippy. But yeah, skippies are coming along. Uh, probably plans are for tomorrow. I've got to spray everything. I'm into that cycle where I'm spraying once a week. I've got crops at various uh, stages of development and uh, trying to keep everything sprayed up. But uh, like I said, we've uh, received our first small check. Wasn't much at all, but it was at least some for uh, product sold. And uh, now we're uh, hopefully getting to cut hay. Uh, the plan is to spray tomorrow evening, uh, go to the field Saturday morning, or yeah, Saturday morning, mow that 20 acres, possibly run a tether through it then, uh, may rake it Monday afternoon and put it up Tuesday uh, that is kind of the best case scenario but uh, we'll be using the new Holland for all that used to mow rake and bale with this uh, John Deere but uh, it's it was barely enough to handle all of it I mean it'll it'll handle it but uh, it's um, just to be honest getting in a hay field with a cab tractor uh, makes a world of difference but uh, anyhow we uh, we're moving along things are progressing and uh, hopefully hopefully we can get some hay cut uh, the crops that are in the field look pretty good I was hoping to be picking sweet corn by the 4th of July it's going to be close. I uh, looked at it today. It uh, uh, maybe, maybe not. It, it'll be next week, probably. So uh, we'll start picking corn, selling hit. That's always a good thing. But uh, once again, if uh, if you like what we're doing, please subscribe to us. Would appreciate it if you are subscribed to us. We do appreciate it. See a video you like. Uh, comment. Let us know. Once again, we're just trying to keep everybody up to date what it what it's like being a small part-time farmer. And uh, some of these videos, I, I guess, aren't very exciting. But uh, <laughs> we're, we're, we're going to be on the tractor some next two days. Uh, unless it just weather forecast changed completely. But... Uh, 
Anyhow, everyone take care of yourself. Have a good night. Thanks for watching. See you later. Bye.